Hi everyone, welcome to the latest Raps from Mini Bite. This week I'm thrilled to say we have Tam Dean Bunn. Now, Tam appeared with Rapture back in 2013 in our production of The Collection by Mike Cullen. Tam is a tremendous actor. He is always fully committed to every part he plays and he feels it so fully in and with such emotion. He's really inspiring to watch. So I'm thrilled he's part of Rapture Mini Bites. Now, Tam will be performing the Edwin Morgan poem, Christmas Eve. So without further ado, I'll hand you over to Tam, who will introduce and perform this week's Rapture Mini Bite. Hello there. My name is Tam Dean Byrne, and I'm delighted to do this uh, Rapture Mini Bite because it's seven years exactly since I worked with Rapture on the collection and uh, seven years is a significant period of time as I realised that I worked on a show called Stones and Ashes with Tom McGrath, uh, a play by Daniel Denis um, and the Jungian sense of seven years is very significant. <laughs> Um, what I have chosen uh, to do here is a poem by Edward Morgan called Christmas Eve, <laughs> a little bit early. Um, but I've chosen this because it gets me back on track um, with doing performances of Edwin Morgan's poems contained in this book, From Saturn to Glasgow. Uh, 50 favourite poems of Edward Morgan. I've done a few so far, um, but uh, with one thing or another, I, uh, I was a bit too busy. So it's been great to get back into it with this wonderful poem, Christmas Eve, uh, that uh, suits very well because it's pretty dramatic, I think. And... Uh, is a lovely piece of work. He, he certainly had an eye for uh, theatre, uh, Edwin Morgan, and uh, he's a great hero of mine, and it's his centenary year. So I am delighted to bring to you Christmas Eve. Hope you enjoy. Thanks. Christmas Eve. Loneliness of city Christmas eves With real stars up there Clear And stars on poles and wires across the street And streaming cars all dark with parcels Home to families and the lighted window trees I sat down in the bus beside him, white jeans, black jerkin, slumped with head nodding in sleep, face hidden with long black hair, hands tattooed on the four fingers, Aiden, 1967. And on the right hand, five Christian crosses. As the bus jerked, his hand fell on my knee. I stayed there. Lay heavily and alive. With blue carvings from another world. And seemed to hold me like a claw. Unmoving. It moved. I rubbed my ear to steal a glance at him. Found him stealing a glance at me. It was not the jerking of the bus. It was a proposition. He shook his hair back and I saw his face for the first time. Unshaven. Hard man, a warning whether in Aden or Glasgow, a 
but our eyes held while that blue hand burned into my leg. Half drunk, half sleeping, but half what, half what? As his hand stirred again, my arm covered it while the bus jolted around the corner. Don't give up, dear, give up. But the conductor was watching. Came up and shook him. Looked at me. My ticket was up. I had to leave him sprawled there with that hand that now seemed so defenseless lying on the seat I had left. Half down the stair I looked back. The last thing I saw was Aden and five blue crosses for five dead friends. It was only 15 minutes out of life, but I feel as if I was lifted by a whirlwind and thrown down on some desert rocks to die of dangers as always far worse lost than run. Thanks, Tom. That was amazing. Excellent. The next Rapture Mini Bite will be available next Friday, so please do follow us on Facebook, Twitter, sign up to our YouTube channel where you can view all the Rapture Mini Bites from the comfort of your own couch, and do keep checking into our website at www.rapturetheatre.co.uk. Stay safe, take care, and we'll see you next week.